to understand the concept of tibc total iron binding capacity transferrin transferrin saturation uibc let us think the our human body as a 100 bedded hotel or resort let us compare our human body imagine that our there is a 100 roomed hotel or resort is there and each hotel uh, each in that each room maximum two people can stay so it's a double bedded 100 rooms or resort uh, rooms are there in that hotel or resort that is the first thing you need to understand so after asking this telling you this let me ask you a basic question that how many numbers of room are there in that hotel answer is 100 i already told you and how many maximum number of people can stay in that hotel or resort answer would be 100 into 2 because one room maximum two people can stay so obviously the maximum number maximum occupancy in that hotel or resort would be 100 into 2 if you have understood up to this i think then it is very simple to understand the concept of the tibc and transferrin level so what happens that we know that in our body there is a iron carrying transferring molecule is there and the molecule is called transferrin the name tells you that i transfer that's why i am called transferrin i am a protein in which transfer iron molecule that's why i am called transferrin and normally transferrin molecule they can bind with two iron sites this is usually we know as per our basic conventional knowledge so we can juxtapose this into that analogy which i have given you so in my analogy which i have given the number of maximum number of room which is available in that hotel or resort whatever you can think is 100 so you can think that the transferring level is equal to the number of maximum number of room which is available in that hotel or resort and total iron binding capacity is the total people who can stay in that hotel or resort that is tibc that is 100 into 2 200 so many times people think that transferring level and tibc is the same thing actually not their same thing similarly as your total number of room in a hotel or total number of people who can stay in the hotel they are not same but they are connected because if your total room number increases your maximum number of people who can stay in that hotel will also increase similarly tibc and transfer level is connected but actually now they are not same they indirectly they are connected with each other so why we get tibc increased in uh, iron deficiency anemia we get tibc increase in iron deficiency anemia because iron deficiency anemia there is no iron storage there is no iron available in the body so i think in this way that body synthesizes more transferrin molecule and they send them in the blood like a pack of uh, hunter wolves who are sent in the blood to collect as much as iron possible wherever it is there to hunt for them so so the key idea is this that in iron deficiency anemia your transferrin increases your total room number in the hotel increases so when your total room number in the hotel increases the maximum number of people who can stay in that hotel would also increase if your room number is currently 100 and 200 people can stay in your hotel if i make your room number in the hotel from 100 to 200 now 400 people can stay in the hotel so that is the basic idea why tibc and increases in the iron deficiency anemia because as transferrin level increases indirectly total iron binding capacity level also increases in the iron deficiency anemia thank you